technical and vocational education plays an important role in economic development, which in the long run helps reduce unemployment challenges in developing countries. Speaking during the Commonwealth Association of Polytechnics Africa Conference in Entebbe, Education and Sports Minister Jessica Alupo affirmed government's commitment to promoting vocational education. Today, worldwide, vocational and technical education combined with entrepreneurship is being seen as a solution to the unemployment challenge caused by the high growth rate in the population <coughs> in Africa. This type of education is being promoted and lauded as the solution to the unemployment problem, especially in the developing countries. Minister Alopo attributes the success of developed countries to their emphasis on practical skills education. Countries that have put emphasis on education have seen numerous changes in the lives of their citizens. Some developed countries like Germany put emphasis on training of technicians and technologists. Indeed, it is reported that their productive capacity is based on their technical knowledge. The principal Makere University Business School, Professor Waswa Balunua, appealed to government to make vocational education mandatory. I think the biggest reform in vocational education will come when Vocational education is no longer a choice, in fact not a choice, for those who fail to proceed to the next level. If we change that, we would have made a fundamental change in the vocational education in Africa. With the initiation of Skilling Uganda project, stakeholders are optimistic that young people will be able to start up businesses as part of the strategy to address youth unemployment within the country. Patricia Lukoma Semidembe and Henry Okurud for UBC News.